Kansas City with the most tenure in the team. And it shows. Most definitely so, I'll tell you after this. Look at this from Philly. Pass into the back. Overlap run. Shot comes in and into the back of the net. Sky Wagner from away outside. What a way to fight on from Brendan Aronson. Cross comes in. It's not picked up by Javier Montero, but it is from Kai Wagner. I don't know if Luis Robles, Alex, perhaps has a... ...around the ball, so a really fun team to watch. Miami looking to try and level things here as Pizarro plays it out to the far side. Decent ball into the middle, glanced away there by Glesnes. Bedoya back there looking to get a foot in. Defending again from Wagner, keep an eye on that. Morgan's a good career in England and Scotland as well with Celtic and Sunderland. But he's very direct, good two-footed as well, looks across the balls in, and you can see that'll be a good matchup between him and Wagner. Morgan can operate on either wing, this time on the right side for Miami. Played in towards Pizarro here. And then the shot towards goal, saved really well there by Blake, who got down to deny Julian Carranza. Well, Blake arrived in this tournament in good form. Had an outstanding debut game in the tournament against New York City FC. He's already made 15 saves in his last two matches. That's another one comfortable in the end for a player of that quality. But Carranza is a number nine looking for his first goal. It's a good chance for him. A second corner of the night for Inter Miami. The pitch here against the Earthquakes. Yeah, they've been watching a lot of soccer dying to get out there themselves. Aronson's ball through it. Shabilko here for Philadelphia. The flag is up. Shabilko doesn't like it. He thought he'd made it too. But it's just offside. I mean, he looked to be in an awful lot of squad because he got a yellow card early and probably should have had a yellow card in the second half to leave him suspended here. He's coming, obviously, to play at the base of midfield. Madunyanin was shipped out to Cincinnati. To the races, counter opportunity. Pizarro wants it. He's not going to get it just yet. Morgan's still on it. Now Pizarro gets it back to Morgan. To the left, Pellegrini inside. Pizarro Golasso. Pizarro Golasso. They finally break that midfield diamond of Philadelphia. And look at the composure here. One touch stuff. Again out to Pellegrini. A fantastic ball in. Like that. He does the rest. Just how calm he is in the box. You can see here he just one touch on the right. Opens up. Sees Blake coming out. Is fully aware of Andre Blake coming out. He's waiting for him to make the move. And then slots on with his left. As two-footed a player as you can have in Major League Soccer, equally good with right and the left. Their main man brings them back into the game, 1-1. One, one. His second Major League Soccer goal, having given Miami the lead at D.C. in Week 2, only to see them give up goals either side of the hour mark to Assad and Briant. And Torres was sent off early in that game against D.C. But Pizarro who scored the first franchise goal for Inter Miami, now has his second for his new team. It's a joy to watch, isn't he? Comes up by oh my, how good would Cavani be in Major League Soccer League? Silvia Petrescu's whistle goes after three minutes of stoppage time and halfway through this Group A encounter. It is tied at 1-1. Magnus first MLS goal giving Philly a fifth minute lead and Rodolfo Pizarro with his second career goal for Inter Miami makes it 1-1. So side had a decent spell after the hydration break in the first half. And they made Philadelphia Union pay with a well taken goal by Rodolfo Pizarro. Trapped with a lovely ball through the middle, it's a chance here for Carranza. And well saved by Andre Blake. It's a great ball in by Trapp. It's a chippy game, 24 foul. Here's a chance for Shabilko. Andres Reyes got back, did just enough to make sure Shabilko couldn't get a decent shot away. And a big mistake there, the ball comes in to Reyes. I talked about him in the first half, not that comfortable in possession. A round of matches will take place in Group A. 
Miami will take on NYCFC. Here it comes towards Morgan, and that's a very good save, low to the right. Not sure if it was on target there from Lewis Morgan, but Andre Blake did really well. It's another good save by Blake. He's actually going the other way at that point as well. He recognizes when the ball comes to Morgan. Diego Alonso and his expansion into Miami coming back from one down to tie things up here and now they're pushing to try and get in front with Pizarro picking this one up and Gaddis will try and clear it away here down that right got ahead to it at the front post but now Philadelphia can bring it away very intelligent leave of the ball from Montero and he leaves it again as this one comes back for Shabilko here Philly on the break Shabilko Picks out the bottom corner in fine fashion. What a counter from Philadelphia. And they are back in front just past the hour mark. What a special goal this is. An outstanding counter-attack by the Philadelphia Union. Look at the dummy from Montero. And there he is again, that magic man, Aronson. The intelligence to drive forward, pick out Montero again. Just let the ball roll past him. The calm and the composure from Shabalko to come inside. He sees sweat. No, thank you. I'm going to go on my left foot. Puts the ball calmly into the corner past Luis Robles. Everything and more that we like about the Philadelphia Union was on show in that movement. Started by the brilliant dummy by Montero. Aronson's drive and the finish by Shabalko. 2-1 Philly. Gaspar Shabilko, the German with his first goal of the season, his 16th career Major League Soccer goal, having led the way last year for Philadelphia. I think the addition. And it's Jose Martinez that's gone down here. Here's the goal again, and you can see it from the counter-attack. What a wonderful view this is. And just ball to just go past the defender he waits for sweat to commit himself Shabalko cuts inside he's already reading the goalkeeper as well that's really important to notice he's taking a look at the goalkeeper's positioning as he sees sweat coming across he has the moment to scan the field and look at where Luis Robles is standing in the middle of it Figal down the right side the challenge comes in from Wagner and it's out for a corner Wagner with his first MLS goal But Shabilko with a wonderful end attack for Philadelphia. Oh, off the bar there as the ball came into the beast, but now they need to get back because here come Philadelphia Union. Aronson charging forward into the middle. And he couldn't get on the end of that one as the ball was played across. For the substitute. What's the chance to put the game away? Action at both. See, just comes across the defender there. Doesn't get the ball. Probably his 